Hi there, it's Fett. I'm co-founder and owner of Azalea Music Group here in Nashville, and I want to welcome you to my crash course in recording fundamentals, guitar vocal edition. I've been a recording guy, a producer, engineer for some 35 plus years, but over those years I've also become a teacher, an author, a coach, a mentor in all things production and recording related. And I teach a lot of courses and I have books and that kind of thing on those subjects. But this one in particular was something I've wanted to do for a really long time. I'd like to tell you a little bit about the background of it so you kind of get an idea of why it's put together the way it is. A while back, a few friends of mine from a company called Songwriters Vantage, which unfortunately no longer exists, approached me about shooting a live video of me teaching a class on recording at a major music industry convention. And the class went really well, fortunately. We had great audience, great questions, really good Q&A, that kind of thing. They did a really great job shooting the video, and they ended up editing it and turning it into a very, very professional DVD. And the DVD did really well. But my one and only regret about the product, if you will, was that while it was really interesting to hear the discussion live and the interaction with the audience and everything, in that environment, I really didn't have a chance to illustrate in detail some of the points I was talking about. I wasn't able to use real gear and a real recording setup and actually go through the specifics, the details of some of the stuff I was discussing. So for a long time, I've wanted to go back to that DVD footage and drop in photos and comments and video and pictures of gear and all that kind of stuff to really illustrate things well. Well, this course is the culmination of that dream. So it's finally done, and that is the format that we're going with. So it's interspersed lots of detail in between the live lecture that I did in class. So that's how the course is put together. I'd like to tell you a little bit about how to use the course to get the most out of it. First of all, there's a lot of material in here. It may not be a weeks long course, but it covers a lot of ground. So what I would recommend you do is go through the course one time, do all the sections, all the modules, all the videos, and sort of watch them start to finish to kind of get an idea, a feel for the material. And then go back at least one more time and go through the steps that are discussed in every one of the modules. Do the stuff, set up the, the gear, make the recordings, listen back, and actually get the true experience of what all the material in the course is about. And you might even want to stop the video from time to time while you're watching and look at the information on the screen and watch the photos and see what the positioning of the mics is and get the web addresses and go check things out, that kind of thing because there's a ton of material in here. If you do it that way, I will guarantee that no matter how long you've been recording or how long you've even been doing guitar vocals, you'll know a lot more about getting a professional quality guitar vocal recording when you're done with the course. So that's how I recommend going through it. At the end of the course, I'll come back and I'll talk a little bit more about some of the other things I offer. I don't just teach courses in recording. I teach courses in mixing and mastering and layering and all sorts of other things. So I'll join you then, but in the meantime, let's join me live in the class and get rocking. My name is Fett. Uh, I'm an independent producer, uh, recording engineer, and studio owner in Nashville with the Azalea Music Group. I've been doing what I do for 30 years, which is a really frightening thing to think about, but uh, 30 years in the business uh, as a producer, recording, all that kind of stuff. Uh, I was the technology editor for Performing Songwriter uh, for seven years, Performing Songwriter magazine. Uh, at which time I learned, uh, after reviewing about 300 pieces of gear and what have you, that it really isn't about the gear. It's really about the techniques that you use in front of the gear and the material you put in front of it. Uh, so that was one of the, the genesis of, uh, of this class. As far as this class goes, this came about as a result of a conversation between myself and Mike Alasco. Uh, over the summer he was saying, it is amazing how often he hears from his screeners how terrible guitar vocal recordings are. The levels are all out of whack. The song starts halfway through the first verse. Things are distorted. You can't hear the vocal. There's so much effect on the, uh, the vocal you can't understand the lyrics, all sorts of things like that. And he, he said, I would love it if you could teach a class uh, to people who made, basically a lot of their living is submitting guitar vocal recordings, how to get a professional sounding guitar vocal so that the recording 
doesn't detract from the quality of the song, but actually represents it well and enhances it. So that's what we're going to talk about today.